game two of today. We have the Chaos Space Marines versus the Blood Angels. We'll see what happens here. This is the same list. Is this the same list that hammered me last game, right? Using a sorcerer instead of a lord. That's the only change from the list. So we'll see what happens. And uh, we're doing Total Annihilation, Spearhead. And here is the KS Space Marines deployment. You're done deploying, right? Yes, I am. And now uh, we got the Blood Angels to set up. And we'll go from there. Go from there. So we got Blood Angel deployment. And they've also stalled the initiative. So the Blood Angels get to go first. And we are playing Total Annihilation Spearhead. So we completed a top of one. Blood Angels, they moved forward. These guys, they moved back? You moved them back? Okay. And Devastator Squad, they shot at the Rhino and immobilized it. And some other shots went on, but nothing happened, right? Yeah. Pretty much. So now we're into the bottom of one. And Tank Hider. Oh, they're going to get out. Tank Hider. Tank Hider. Whoa, dice are flying all over. Okay. So impressive damage round for the Chaos Space Marines. The Defiler shot at the Tactical Squad over here. We did deem that quite a few of them were hidden by the line of sight from the dread in the front. So I did give them a 4 plus cover save. And then they went to ground to get to 3 plus, which helped because they only lost 3 out of that. Um, so we're moving into the top of 2. And really not to say there from more to come. Right, but you chose to go to ground, so that's a difference. Um, so, top of two for Blood Angels? Yeah. We're in the bottom of two for the Chaos Space Marines. Uh, but the tap, the Salt Squad here, they did move over this direction. Some shooting went over there to the Dread, but just didn't do nothing. And that is all. Oh, and the Terminators did move into the terrain. And the tap Squad is now up from going to ground. So we are into the bottom of two. Chaos Space Marines. So we're moving on to the top of three for the uh, bottom of two. The Sorceress used Lashed and pulled the Terminator seven inches and then the Dread assaulted and uh, wiped out quite a few of them. Only one Terminator remains. The Demon Prince uh, blew up the Blood Angel's Dread there with a lot of hits. And the Defiler tried to shoot at the Tackle Squad again this time, but it drifted off into the train, so no damage. So, so now we're just starting off the top of three. And we're deep striking just a regular. Is that the Vanguard vets? Yeah, they're heroic intervention. Heroic intervention. I didn't want to yell, yell that out while you're having comments. Oh, that's okay. That's uh, okay. So. Um, so we're in three, and um, fast attack. They try to shoot at the rear of the dread, failed. The relentless uh, missile launcher dudes. They shot at the dread and managed to immobilize it. So that's good. The snipers and devastator squad try to take out the demon prince, but failed. The veteran vanguard are now into assault. Are they both the same? Is that all one unit? That's not all one unit. No, the Corn Berserkers. So, and, you're, and you choose to assault the Corn Berserkers, is that correct? Yeah. Okay. So now we're doing the assault phase here for the Veteran Vanguard. Top of three. So the uh, Dread over there went ape shit and uh, killed out what, one Terminator? Yep. So. Left. And we were at the bottom of three. Demon Prince moved forward. The veteran vanguard, they didn't survive, it looks like. And that's all. The uh, obliterators, right? Terminators with the sorceress, they attacked the fast attack and uh, wiped them out. Mm, that was pretty much it. So, and that uh, predator moved forward. And they're surgical striking in with the goldies. Alright, then. Finally came down, okay? So we'll see what happens. Finally got over here. Terminator's coming in and says, You're going to die. Demon Prince, you're going down. Because I shot smart at S-Mart. 
So we had this close combat that happened during the bottom of three. Uh, a flamer came out first and softened the gold dudes up. But uh, Dante was really, really upset and managed to get a wound on the demon prince. If you didn't have tank hunters, you wouldn't be able to hit the defiler to land armor. I do have tank hunters. And we're doing an assault phase now with the devastators versus the defiler. The sorcerer here cast lash and then moved them into range so that the devastator could uh, assault. Uh, the defiler, sorry, can assault the devastators. And that's pretty much it for the bottom of three. We gotta finish off the assault phase and then we'll go on the top of four. So the Devastator squad, they managed to get six sixes and uh, did a weapon destroyed on the Defiler. And we lost a banner guy over here for the gold dudes. And we're into the top of five. Uh, Devastator, Yep, screw that. So the top of four, Dante's the last remaining soldier. He don't care, he's coming for you. You're five. And see what happens. Did the Defiler just moved over? Just for fun, we're going to see what a Defiler will do with its blast. Alright. Just go right over there. Drifting! Drifting! Three inches. That really? That's about what I have set up. Oh, how many? I have all my Three of them. Three. All right, two pluses. Oh, he takes out two of his own guys. Well, it's AP three, so I do get, I do get one. So I'll take it on the one of the fish. All right, I'll get it.